so all these things uh, they are often ignored nowadays because we are being thought of as computers or competitors to computers that is the problem and and you know whenever i hire anyone whenever uh, we have some people coming in and trying to work for us uh, we look at it very very positively okay you have had a gap what were you doing at that time what was the focus area were you focusing on your mental health if you were what were the outcomes did you get anything out of that it's always I, and i think it's 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 required also that's very important because if we keep working 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 we don't learn new things we forget to explore only only when we you know stop and look for a while just by sitting or you know mentally standing and sitting and looking for a while we get to explore things around us you know, that's and, very and you really get to know what you want from life yes yes you uh, because our education system is designed in such a way that you never really get the time to really think what you because engineering is a default option for all of us most of us i'd like yes, to say yes so that time when you are graduating from the college third or fourth year maybe that is i guess for most of us i think most of us would like to would 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 be able to relate to me that your sec third and fourth year of your college is the first time when you really think about what you want in life mm. and often by that time it's too late mm. so i think a gap year is okay and if you can justify it in your interview it is not going to damage because i with a multiple years of gap i still did make it to the uh, grade b post so yes. 